this is my first time to Sun Valley and I'm just blown away. I mean, every mountain you look at, you just want to climb or go ride. And Mountain biking in Sun Valley is amazing. It is definitely a biker's dream. Sun Valley has endless single track. Uh, you can get out in the mountains and feel like you're you know, in the middle of nowhere when realistically you're 20 minutes from town. They have a new machine-built jump trail that's super long, um, goes from the top or the roundhouse, really flowy, in and out of views and trees and um, lots of variety. It was a great time. Being able to get on that gondola, go to the top of the mountain, and then come right back to the bottom of the gondola. A true blue flow trail, some big jumps, nice large radius berms. Uh, definitely something that's escalating uh, riding in Sun Valley in a good way. They have um, downhill flow trails, um, lots and lots of single track, um, some of it's rocky and technical, um, and then there's some nice big buff berms also. Um, but I think the best part about it is you know the 360 views of all the ranges that you get. The Warm Springs Trail starts here at the base of Warm Springs Day Lodge and you just traverse right on up. We have some really nice gradual climbing, a little bit of relief on some of the flat sections, but once you hook up with that traverse trail, you crest over and once you descend right into River Run Trail, it's, it just makes for a really great combination. All of the trails have a little bit of everything. You know, there's some nice sweeping turns with real smooth track, and then there's some shaly sections, and then there's grassy sections where you've got tall grasses on either side of you. And if you take a minute to look up the hill, the wildflowers are just exploding. And so you just, you really get a little bit of everything. We're standing here at White Clouds. This is right across from the resort. You can pop right out from the lodge take a five mile loop out here. It's a really fun trail to ride. There's nothing too difficult as far as, you know, not any real long steep pitches or, or sharp descent. So it, it makes it really doable for the entire family. You're riding right into the sun and you have these incredible mountain tops ahead of you. And you're kind of just weaving in and out of these different ravines and in grasses and rock features and it's incredible. E-bikes are a super easy way to get into biking. Um, very minimal effort is required to really go places. The bikes that we brought in are just for pavement. Um, so anywhere on the bike path, um, anywhere on the city streets, um, they're great for riding around whether you're commuting or trying to get out for some exercise. You still pedal, so you still feel like you're getting that workout, and it's that true biking experience. It's just that little extra help kind of pushes you along the trail and uh, really makes it enjoyable. We stopped at the clubhouse after uh, e-biking. Sat on the deck on a beautiful evening, had some cocktails and some appetizers. Super good fish tacos, awesome hummus plate. So are you guys ready for your clubhouse cookie? It's a hot chocolate chip cookie made in-house. It's gooey, it's warm, and it's right out of the baker. Mm. Mm. That is good. It was a really nice way to just kind of close out the evening um, after a day of riding hard. We always tell people, you come for the winter, you stay for the summer. You could spend your whole summer here and continue finding new trails.